Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sundell and today I'm going to be playing a demo for the game. Last time I saw you, we don't have a release date yet other than that it's planned to release this year. So don't have to wait too long at least. All I know about the game so far is that it has to do, I'm reading it from the Steam page here, First Loves, Family Issues, Yokai, which are ghosts, and that it's set in the 1980s in Japan and that it's a coming of age story. I've only seen a little bit of the gameplay trailer. I don't like to spoil myself by looking at the full trailer. Um, so uh, I'm just gonna jump into this demo with without much more info other than what I just mentioned right now. So let's get right into it. But before we do, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. It's a free way to help me out and it does help me out a lot. Thank you so much. All right, let's start the demo. This is beautiful already. The mystery of love is greater than the mystery of death. Oscar Wilde. Oh my God, that little ghost is so cute. I move? No. Hello? <gasps> okay. He's so cute! <gasps> oh, he reminds me of my son. <laughs> my oldest son. I have two boys, but they're very different in appearance. One has dark hair like me, and then the other one is blonde like his father. So we can jump. Okay, none of the buttons do anything else. So just jump so far. So, so far, right off the bat, the colors and sort of like watercolor scheme reminds me of... Ooh! Reminds me of Gris. If you've ever played that game, uh, it's by um, a Spanish game studio called Nomada and absolutely beautiful. So that just kind of reminded me of that end that just makes me happy. It's just a beautiful, beautiful color scheme so far. So there's a yokai, a ghost. Who is she? That girl again. Why do, should I do voices? Why do I keep dreaming about her? I don't even think we met before. So I tend to do voices when I do playthroughs, especially like on, on stream, on Twitch and stuff. <laughs> and I don't know why my little kid voice is always like, I don't understand. Like, I always like, I like to do little kid voices like this. And someone said that it is my Ash Ketchup. And yes, ketchup, not ketchup, because it's like wish.com ash ketchup voice. <laughs> and maybe now you won't be able to unhear it. Man, that nap was long. Aren't those little birdies the one up, up top? Oh, what are their names? Are they like sparrows or swallows? Aren't those the ones? I'm watching an anime called Black Clover, and it's like if they, they're drawn to non-magic, or the more that follow you, the less mana and magic you have. Anyways, don't mind my ADHD brain. Man, that nap was long. The sky is getting dark. Maybe the typhoon will hit us sooner than expected. Then I wouldn't have to go to school tomorrow. Hmm. Well, I still have some weekend left ahead. Okay, fall colors already, I'm loving this. Why? Okay. What? Oh. I still have to finish my homework for tomorrow. Well, do your homework. Do your homework. Bah. I'll do it later. No, do your homework. Get it done and over with. Ah, oh, child. Mom took my raincoat and rubber boots downstairs so I can wear them. She says flood water is more dangerous than the storm itself. But it's not like the house will sink underwater. Oh my god, he's drawn on the closet doors. Right? Oh, his name, okay. Ayumi. His name's Ayumi? 
Thank you, Duolingo. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Can I see out the window? This plant has always been taller than me. But I'll catch up to you any day now. I'm right, right? Ah, uh, you. Yeah, are you me? Mom and Dad's bedroom is empty. They must be downstairs. <laughs> yeah, I was right. Oh, Ayumi. If you take such long naps, you won't be able to sleep at night. Then, <coughs> excuse me, let me just take a drink. Then you read for hours and no one can wake you up in time for school. Come on now. Didn't you do the same when you were his age? Wait, did you really? Not, n not that much. He must get it from my side then. You wanted me to buy something, right? Yes, can you bring me some carrots? I forgot to buy them this morning. Haven't we bought enough supplies already? Even if the typhoon traps us at home, we must have enough for a year to spare. I know how you two can get stuck at home without comfort food. And you know what's a good meal and you know what's Blah, I'm sorry. And you know what's a good meal for a stormy day? What? Curry rice. Oh, that sounds so good. Nice. Oh, they're so cute. I love all the details, like the incense burning for grandpa, most likely. Hey grandpa. Hope you're doing fine, wherever you are. Wait, what can I do here? What are you eating? Ubasute by Osamu Dazai. You know, the writer who always tried to kill himself? They told us about him at school the other day. I want to look into that. Is it cool? I like it. Probably not for your age, though. Why not? Some things in life need time before they ring true, buddy. Oh, that's such a good way to say that, or like to put it. They're still talking about the typhoon. They've been like this all week. Dad is so classy. Look at them so cute, just chilling with each other, just side by side and just enjoying each other's company, not necessarily having to do the same thing, but just enjoying each other's company. That's a sign of a healthy relationship. Okay. Prologue. I'm so sad this is just a demo right now. Daydreams. Look at all the colors, all the fall color. Oh, the fall leaves are falling. It's so beautiful. My favorite season narrative story game, Japanese themed. Oh, I'm so sad this is just a demo. More protest signs about the village's plans to expand into the forest. I mean, that makes sense. They shouldn't leave the forest alone. They're everywhere. Why won't they just cancel it and so many people are against it? Because money, money runs the world, unfortunately. I love this Odin. When I grow up and live by myself, it'll be the only thing I'll eat. But then I guess I'll miss mom's food. Ugh, so many hard decisions to make. Oh no, are these bullies? Yo! Hey, Manabu! No, hey, Manabu! Sorry. How's your training? Not as good as it could be. Wanna help? Sorry, I gotta go to town first. But I'll be back as soon as I'm done. Sure, take your time. Hey, you're not getting sick, are you? You look kinda pale. It's nothing. Just another dream. Another man! Hurry back from town and tell me about it. Okay, so not bullies. Good, 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 good. Uh, don't hit me. Watching Manabu train again? 
He promised he'd pass the next tryout and enter the team. So we're watching him train before he gets cool. Plus, who doesn't like an underdog? Hey, shut up. I'll make it in this time. I've always liked these small shrines. Grandpa once told me they were made to honor some kind of goddess. I hope this goddess will protect us from the typhoon. Should I, should I ask her? Yes. Uh, um, <clears throat> hi, goddess. Sorry, I don't remember what you were the goddess of. Anyways, these big typhoons will be coming soon, and, and my parents are quite worried about it. I don't know if you exist or not, but just in case, I ask for your protection. They're nice people. So, yeah, that's all. Thank you. Uh, um, bye. <laughs> I hope this is the right way to town. I didn't even explore... I don't think this is town. The forest. Everyone in town avoid... Avoid its... Avoids. Typo. Avoids its silence if they can. I was so young when I ventured inside. Too young to even remember what it was like. Mom says she's never been more scared in her life. But still, there's something mesmerizing about it. Staring at these steps scares me and draws me in at the same time. Like it's going to swallow me whole. I should get going. Okay. Koban. Hey, Ayumi. What troublemaking have you been up to lately? Are you plotting something? Perhaps planning to rob the shop across the bridge? Wait, what? Haha, <laughs> just kidding. You are free to go. But remember, I'm watching you. I think the typhoon is making him nervous. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Hold down an A to drop down. Oh, and then just, just jump up. Okay, wait, 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 but now I want to go down. I also want to go explore what was on the right side of the map. Huh? Kanta once said he became friends with the Kappa that lived down here. The adults in town got alarmed and investigated whether it was true. In the end, they said it wasn't a Kappa, just a bald homeless man. Everyone made fun of the poor kid. But sometimes, I still wonder. Wait, can I... Can I go down? No. Okay. So that's probably gonna be an area that's unlocked. Oh, okay. That's unlocked uh, in the full game. I love this shop. I wish I had the money to buy something. Actually, thinking about it, Mom just gave me some money. No. Be a good son. Be a good son. Yeah, go away. <gasps> Ooh, girlies. Hey, Ayumi. <laughs> Will you snitch? No. We want to try smoking. <gasps> but we don't have any money. Will you lend us some? Eh, why would I do that? Come on, obviously we can't ask our parents. And you're the one always talking about wanting to become an adult. You should understand, adults smoke all the time. Not all of them. But your father smokes, doesn't he? Uh, our father smokes too. Everyone does. Look, if you give us the money, we'll give you the answers for the upcoming test. How do you even know them? We have our sources. I don't want to give you money for that. Good luck studying then, loser. <gasps> She's cute! Ayumi! What's up now? Thank goodness you came. Awful business today. No one has bought any books. Is it that bad? I'm trying my best to help my father with the bookstore. But most people keep coming to read for free. I have to keep my eyes peeled. Anyways, how are you doing? Done with homework yet? Mm, eh. I'll do it later. 
Ayumi, you're starting to lag behind. You have to get your act together. Yeah, I know, I know. It's just that I've been having these weird dreams. I'm having a hard time focusing. Last time I did your homework, you promised this wouldn't happen again. I know, don't worry. This time I'll do it myself. I mean, if you need help, I can help. I really don't mind. We could do them together next weekend. Thank you now. You're always so nice. That's what friends are for, right? Oh, she's sweet. Can I pet the cat? Oh, make it possible to pet the cat. Suck on a fish. Oh. Carrots. We need to buy the carrots. Oh, I'm sick of your fish. Wait. Oh, I have to push the button. Sorry, I was waiting for the dialogue to go on itself. They stink! Oh, I'm not the one mopping the streets with blood. If it wasn't for, I for the ice you leave scattered all around, the floor wouldn't be so wet. If I don't use ice, the fish will rot. Oh, come on. They're already rotten. Who are you trying to fool? Let's see how your steaks handle the moisture once the typhoon hits the town. Here they go again. May the typhoon blow them both away. Anyways, what can I do for you? Fresh carrots from our village. Mom wants me to buy them for dinner. Yes. Eight. Hold to buy. Okay. Any... Wait, what was the voice? Any... Whoa, it was like an old man voice. Eh. I'm lost on the voice. I lost it. Oh, man. Anything else? No, that's all. Thanks. Hmm. I could still hang around a little. Yeah, let's go adventure. <gasps> I've always hated people who eat the taiyaki Sorry. from the tail. If they did it from the head, they wouldn't be suffering such a horrible and painful death. You know these aren't real fish, right? They are made of red bean paste. You are such a horrible human. <gasps> you have no feelings. Get away from my shop! Oh my gosh, that was very aggressive. I wanna go in the tea room. Now sister must be on shift. That cheesecake she makes is incredible. She still won't let me drink coffee, but it smells so delicious. One day, perhaps one day I can convince her. Hey guys, C come uh, w what will you have? Uh, I don't know, Sachi. Whatever you order. But, but, wouldn't it be better to order different things so we can try both? Uh, anything you like. So, what will you have? Uh, whatever you order. Wait, what? I haven't even noticed I'm here. I wonder why people get so silly when they fall in love. <laughs> Uh-oh. These are no good. What are you looking at? Piss off, kid. Damn. Ugh. Stop. Coming soon. Ah, uh, and then we'll be able to jump up top. Can we jump on the wall here? No. This also reminds me a lot of Spirit Fair. Oh, man. Okay, we're gonna go over to the right now. I don't even know if we were able to go up into the forest, were we? Or at least maybe not yet. It's very ominous. Mysterious. Hey! No more excuses now. You grab the bat and I pitch you some balls. How does that sound? Let's do this. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, how do I hit? Ready? Here I come. Oh no. Press X to attack. Oops. 
Really? Good one! Come on, man, I thought you were better! So, still having those, these freaky dreams? Oh, my bad. Man! They're not that freaky. There's this girl. I've been having the exact same dream for days now. And they feel almost too real. That's weird. I've never had the same dream several times in a row. Hell yeah! Good job! Neither did I. This is the first time. That girl, does she uh, talk to you or something? I think we won't be seeing that ball anymore. Oh, I love that. No, she's just there. And when I get close, she disappears. I don't think I ever saw her face. Man, you're nuts. Doesn't she kind of look like now? You play too many video games. Ain't nothing wrong with that. You should swing the bat more often. Get some fresh air in that thick head of yours. You're joking, right? I suck at this. Don't I make for a pretty good trainer? Nice! Yeah! Whoosh! How come you aren't in the school team yet? Thank you for helping me train. I really need to pass the tryouts for the baseball team this time. Don't worry, man. You're doing great. If I fail again... Anyways, don't worry about those dreams. I'm sure they'll eventually stop. As soon as you get a girlfriend. Come on, shut up. <laughs> Maybe that's your fate, man. I don't argue with dreams. What are you now, an expert in dream interpretation? <laughs> you wish. Oh, you can practice again. Cute. <gasps> Look at how many kitties, a little calico kitty. Okay. This is mi casa, right? No. That's my casa. <gasps> pet the dog, pet the dog. Hey, buddy. Oof, oof. <laughs> Still hopping over the fence in search of adventures. <laughs> Good boy. You won't tell anyone? Of course not. Well, my sister's acquaintance cousin saw her with the fishmonger. Oh my goodness. My uh, my husband's co-worker's wife's friend saw her with the butcher too. Butcher too. The sister's cousin's acquaintance is what? Are they making it up? <laughs> this is the way to school. Hopefully the road gets destroyed by the typhoon. Oh my god. Okay, so there wasn't... Oops. Wasn't much to explore then. Um. So then let's go back to mom. A few hours later. Such nice sounds. Ah, uh, dinner was great. Mom's food almost made me forget about homework. Do your homework. The sooner I get to it, the sooner I'll finish. Yes, that's the that's the way to think. That's that's correct. <laughs> well, it wasn't that bad. Is there anything else to see? See if we can see anything outside. It's getting colder. That's so pretty. There's like a shrine at the very top of the mountain over there. Okay. Well, weekend is over.
Will I see you again tonight? Ooh. Okay, let's go. I wonder how long the demo is. I have no idea how long this is. Oh, warn a dark mode user. Here again. Why are all my dreams like this now? It's so beautiful here, though. There she is. I hope this isn't like some sort of like premonition of now, now uh, dying or something in the typhoon. Like some sort of foreshadowing or something. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, it's a dream. Anything can happen in dreams, right? I know this place. Sort of. Hello? No? Is that you? You've always been so nice to me. Sorry if I don't pay much attention to you lately. It's hard to explain, but I've been really distracted recently. Push. Did I push it? Yeah, okay. Is there fall damage? No, okay. <laughs> who are you? H hey! H who are you? Do you want to talk to me? Oh, she just barely turned around. Oh, we missed it. Her face. I finally saw her face. Who are you? What are you trying to tell me? So he would have recognized if it was now. I should get ready for school. Okay, but I want to look outside. Just, I just want to see the morning. Oh. Wow, look at the sky. I haven't seen anything like this before. And this wind. Ah, uh, oh, okay, cute. Thought there was something else, okay. All right, let's go. Let's go to school. Ready to learn and get some knowledge. Ayumi? Yeah? Come see me in the living room before you leave. Ooh. Could I have been here, bef gone here before? It smells like Dad's fragrance. He always leaves for work before I wake up. Okay. Have you seen the sky? It's crazy! Yeah. The news said the typhoon might come sooner than expected, but that it's still safe to go to school today. Shit. Hey, watch your tongue. Sorry. Before you leave, I want you to take this. It's a beaded charm bracelet that Grandpa used to wear. It's supposed to protect you. I'd rather protect you myself, but... Grandpa's beaded charm bracelet. The bracelet Grandpa always used to wear, wearing it makes me feel like he's still around. It protects who wears it from evil spirits. Uh, thanks. Just be careful, okay? Do as the teachers say and come back as soon as school is over. Sure, Mom. And Ayumi? Yes, Mom. I love you. I love you, too. Mm. 
so sweet. I'm glad he didn't be like, ugh, me too, mom, or something. My sons are like that. One of them, if we, when we say I love you, what the little one, we have this little competition thing where it's like, in Spanish, we'll be like, no, yo mas, no, yo mas, like, no, me more, I love you more, no, I do, no, I do. And then the oldest one, he doesn't like that. He doesn't like that one would love one more than the other. So we have to both say, love you, infinity. So, amo, amo, infinity, amo, infinity, love you, infinity. It's really cute. <laughs> what kind of weather is this? Grandma always... <clears throat> Sorry, hold on. Grandma always told me to put rocks in my pocket so I don't fly away when the wind blows hard. I don't have any rocks, but I'm sure these stupid math books aren't more than enough. Alright, let's go to school. The rain is just so cozy. Ayumi, wait for me! Oh wait, is it gonna be now? Oh no. Come on, we're gonna be late. Man, that weather is crazy. I know, what more do they need to cancel classes? Don't jinx it, I still have my baseball tryouts tomorrow. Uh, I hope you're a good swimmer. <laughs> Don't jinx it. What took you so long? I'm soaking wet. Sorry now. Let's go inside. Class is about to start. Why couldn't you wait inside? A few hours later. And as we were saying last week, the work of Osamu Dazai has been of great importance thanks to its strong autobiographical traits and rebelliousness in a period of conformism, making him one of the most iconic authors of the 40s. Kids? Are you even paying attention? I don't even know whose voice that is. I've never seen a sky like this before. Is the wind gonna break the windows? Everyone back to your seats. We are here to study, not to be looking out the window. It's just a storm. You have nothing to worry about. You were saying? Attention, attention. Authorities have informed us that Typhoon number two. Oh shoot, what did I put? What did it say? Typhoon number 23 something. Please remain calm. Oh, I pushed too fast. All teachers must stop their lessons immediately and walk their students to the auditorium. This is not a drill. Remain calm and do as you're told. Okay. <laughs> I want to go home. Please don't scream. Calm down. Everyone stand outside the classroom. I'll be right here. What do you mean there? I'll be right there. Shit, man. Are we gonna die? Don't be silly. Though my father left town this morning. Is he alright? My father's off to work as well. We should be safe inside the auditorium. The typhoon can't destroy such a big structure. But the other day, I watched a documentary on TV about twisters. They can destroy entire villages. Oh my god, really? I don't know who's saying what. But this is a typhoon, not a twister. So please, calm down and let's go. The auditorium across the... <clears throat> the auditorium's across the yard. There's no way I'm going out there. Come on, kids, hurry up. Ayumi. <gasps> that voice. Didn't, didn't anyone else hear it? Hey, guys. Uh, go, go ahead. I left something in the classroom. Are you sure? Yeah, it won't take long. Be careful, please. See you there. Is she here? It, it can't be possible. There is no one here. I thought I heard a girl. Run. <gasps> Again! What's going on? 
This is no typhoon. I have to get out of here. Oh shit. What are those things? That scared me. Oh shoot. It hurt me. I can't push the door wide open. There's storm debris blocking it from the outside. Oh, it's really loud. So let me just turn the volume down here a bit. Okay. I hope that's okay for you. A normal bat taken from school, often used in PE class, it can also be used to break things. Okay. That window over there. I can break it. Okay, but I want to explore a little bit. I want to explore the school. Or not. I want to go upstairs, too. Oh, boy. Okay, so can't go up anymore. Is this where I was? Okay, so there really isn't much more here. Ah! Oh my gosh! All right. Let's go break it then. Oh boy, what's going on? It's too dark. Come on, Ayumi. The auditorium is just ahead. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shoot. Oh, he's in. Oh, that hurt. Okay, so. What is this? Grandpa's bracelet? It glows. Is it protecting me from these things? How can this be? Run. That voice. Run. Run. Run, 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 run. I did run. I can't. I tried smacking it. I'm trying to smack it. Oh no. Oh shoot. There he is. Someone call an ambulance. Is he still alive? Yeah, he just lost consciousness. Hurry up! Let's bring him inside. No! Oh, I want to see more! <laughs> A first love and terrible curse. Thank you so much for playing the demo wishlist now. Join our Discord. Go back to the main menu. No! I want to play more! <laughs> I'm so sad this is just a demo. Okay, that that's... Okay. All right. I don't know what else more I could say about this other than the fact that I wish it wasn't just a demo. I loved everything about this so far. I got fully immersed into it and... That was such a cliffhanger of, a, of an ending right now to the demo. And oh, I can't wait for it 
to release. I I have theories. I I have theories. I'm thinking because it says it's in here at the at the end scene here. Um, uh, a first love and a terrible curse. So. I'm thinking that she, this yokai, right? I'm thinking she and him were probably like soulmates or something in a previous life. And somehow she's stuck in the soul world. I don't know. Like my, my brain's going crazy because it's the last time I saw you. So somehow there is a pre-relationship, pre-connection of some sort. Um... And then the whole like a first love, you know, so so I, who knows where this story is going to lead, but I'm really, really excited. It was giving a lot of like spirit fair uh, vibes as well, which I, I love that game. And and like the, I was saying, the colors kind of reminded me of Greece, which just kind of brings me to a happy place. It was just absolutely beautiful uh, work. So really, really looking forward to it. You can try the demo out yourself on Steam. Also, please make sure to wishlist it as well as that really helps out the game studio. And just a huge shout out to Mavoroshi Artworks as well, because they're an indie studio. They're based in Japan as well. So please go go support them. Wishlist the game. Try the demo out yourself. All of this really, really helps and supports them. Uh, so I hope you enjoy that demo playthrough. Please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel as it helps me out a lot. And I will see you in the next video.